Vice President Mike Pence is in South Florida this noon. He came here straight from the president's event in Arizona last night. Later today, Mr. Pence is expected to address the Venezuelan community at a popular church in Doral. CBS 4 Ted's Count is live in Doral with the latest. Ted? Yeah, Elliot, first the Vice President will be speaking to members of the U.S. Southern Command. After that, he will head over here to Our Lady of Guadalupe Church in Doral. You can see uh, already people are filing in here. Uh, he's going to be meeting with the Venezuelan community here. Um, you, uh, before he speaks, he will be holding a listening section as people voice their concerns about Venezuela. Vice President Mike Pence arriving in Miami early this morning. He has a long day ahead, meeting with members of the Venezuelan community, and there's a lot to talk about. Earlier this month, Venezuelan leader Nicolas Maduro had his new constituent assembly sworn in. That's expected to give him sweeping powers. <laughs> Meanwhile, protests are growing in Venezuela as people rally against Maduro's plans. With unrest and violence escalating, Venezuelans living here want to make sure that the president understands the importance of TPS, or temporary protected status, for Venezuelans fleeing their homes. It's very important the Venezuelan people have a TPS for they come to this country. But it's very bad the people is illegal in this country. It's very difficult their life. People began lining up this morning outside of Our Lady of Guadalupe Church in Doral. It's here where the vice president will hold a listening session to hear people's concerns about what's happening in Venezuela. Communism and uh, socialism is like a cancer. It's hard once those people get in there. It's hard to take him out. Luis Pina supports President Trump in his efforts to help the Venezuelan resistance. He says Maduro and his regime needs to go. No, it's government. It's mafia. It's under control. The, our people, 30 million people right now, is under control. The mafia, international mafia, gangster, kill the people. And a live look now inside Our Lady of Guadalupe Church in Doral. The vice president will speak here to the crowd after four this afternoon. Now, after that, he's going to be heading to Miami International Airport for a six o'clock flight back to Washington, D.C. So as you can imagine, Doral already has gridlock during that time. It's evening rush hour, so you can expect it to be even worse. So plan accordingly. Live in Doral, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News. Important for people to know that, Ted. Thanks a lot. And you can watch the vice president's address this afternoon streaming live on our website, CBS Miami. Again, he's scheduled to speak at 4 p.m.